Welcome everyone back. Welcome back to Minecraft. Um, I know I haven't been uploading because I was waiting on cords from Australia and China to get every, my whole setup for YouTube. And well, I have it all now. You'll be able to hear my friends talking finally in in the games that I play. And uh, school's almost over. I'm currently in university. If some of you don't know. Uh, I just finished up one exam today, and I got another one that is uh, next Saturday. So there won't be any videos on a daily basis, I want to say, for a while still. Um, for right now, I'm just going to be doing a little bit of Minecraft, just so that I can kind of relax after finishing my exam. And... Uh, I just want to give you guys an update that uh, we will we will soon be in full swing to actually record and uh, post up videos and uh, I'm thinking like every Monday, Wednesday, or Friday. I think I've said that before, and I put up some videos and I stopped for a while and it's been on and off. But I want to make sure I had all these cords and having my setup all set up well. So then you guys can hear my friends, because it's very awkward to have a conversation with someone, and you guys only hearing me, and not anyone else. But, uh, yeah. Um, for, for those who are still here, how's it going? Hope everyone's well. Um, I've gotten games uh, recently that will be on the channel. Uh, you'll be, you guys will be seeing some Dying Light. Uh, Battlefield Hardline came out, and I uh, got that. That's a lot of fun. Be playing some of that. And, uh, yeah, we're just going to try and get this thing started, finally. Hopefully. That's the plan. So, today, what we're going to be doing is, as I said, just kind of finish up some exams. I don't really feel like concentrating too much. But, um, we are going to play some Minecraft. And, as you guys may know or may not know... I've actually just started this one, as you guys can see, I'm level 1, um, where's my map? See my map here? Haven't really explored that whole lot. I actually spawned just over by that sand mountain over there. There's a video above it where I'm saying, oh yeah, I'm waiting for some stuff to come in. But, uh, yeah, let's get started. So, Minecraft, I'm not really a noob when it comes to it. I'm not a hardcore guy that plays on a PC just because I prefer the console, even though I'm sure the PC is better in so many ways. Um, but uh, this is... So we spawn right beside this town, and what I like to do personally is I like to stay in the town, and I like to protect all these villager guys over here. Look at these guys. What are you doing? What What are you doing? Oh, let's, let's save you. Uh... How can I do that? Do you have any dirt? I do have some dirt. Alright, well, let us... Yeah, I'll put this... What? Nope. Wait! You give Ender Eyes for eight emeralds? Oh my gosh, we are keeping you alive! Oh, you get your butt up there, sir. I'm gonna lock you away in a room. That sounds really cruel, but I can't let you die. That's amazing! Ender Dragon, all that stuff? Like, I understand that some people might say, Oh, well, you have to get legit. Which is fine, and I can totally do that. It's not the first time I fought the Ender Dragon, but, you know, it'll definitely save some time. Now, you gotta get out of the water, and you just keep going place to place, and you're going in. I guess I could just, like, build a wall around you right here. Oh, there we go. Get out of the water. I don't care about you. What do you have? Not interested. Not interested. Okay, you got to... We got to move. Really wish there was an item and get these guys to move. And I know, like, with um, sheep, I think it's wheat. And pigs, it's carrots. I need to keep you alive. Alright, so... What I should do first... I stole some uh, stuff over here, some materials. Uh, where's my house? Is this my house? This is my house. Okay, so I guess I should get some doors, get some torches. I don't have any coal, do I? No, I don't. I think there's like a little lava deposit over here that had some coal. Um, if you guys, uh, you guys might notice in the future that uh, 
I'll probably have some of my friends playing these games. And then when I'm playing Minecraft, I might uh, be in their games. So it'll be switched up every now and again. But this is... This game I started because I wanted to start this game with you guys. So, kind of, you know, start for right from the beginning. And we might start um, another one in the future. But the plan is not to die. The plan is to... I don't know if there's really a plan for Minecraft. Um, just kind of build shit and... Uh, not die and fight the inner dragon and then i think there's like a three-headed beast that they added as a boss so fight that thing eventually um but yeah let's work on the town here wheat's almost done oh mr pig i think and i might just encase that guy in uh in cobblestone for the time being if he doesn't want to leave there oh you know what i can do i can wait for night and then at night, oh, there he is. At night time, they're all scurrying into the houses, and then I can lock them in there. Oh, well, this isn't good. Uh, I gotta build a shovel. Da, 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 da. So, um, I'm just trying to think of some commentary to talk to you guys about. Like, I would like to talk to you, I just don't really know exactly what to say. Um, how's it going, of course, you know, if you guys want to tell me how you're doing. Uh, how are things? Um, if you want to know a little bit about me, um, I'm currently going to university right now for uh, human resource management. Was that guy stuck in there the whole time? Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. Wait, can you get out this way? Oh, yeah, he can get out this way. Whatever. Um, human resource management. And uh, the main reason why I'm doing... Oh, don't you step in front of me. Stop it. Stop it. Get out of here. Wait, what do you do? Oh, I can get oh I can get wheat from emeralds. Oh, I gotta I gotta save you too. So don't walk in front of me. Um, I'm going for human resource management just because I like to talk to people and uh, I like to help people out. That's why when I'm making this channel, I'd like to eventually down the line do some charity live streams and whatnot. Um, when that happens, I have no idea because. I have to have some, well, I guess I could like donate it myself and then just have you guys watch, but I would like to get like a kind of a group going and then everyone participate and do well or like, or don't even donate, just, you know, spread the word and just kind of be there for each other. If that sounds kind of sappy. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's what I've been doing and uh, the semester's almost up. I got one more exam, which is actually my a class called Human Resources that I'm taking, which is next Saturday. And then after that, I'll have some time off. I'll be looking for a job. So I'll probably be working and uh, doing some YouTube over the summer, getting some cash. And then, uh, and then probably go back to school in September and keep working at it. So I'm, I'm two years in. So... I, I have an idea, but then I really... I'm still trying to figure things out. Okay, there you are. Where are you going? Which house are you want to go into? Is this the other guy? Yes. Okay, I need to keep you two safe. So I'm going to follow you two. Where are we going? Why don't, why, why don't you guys go in here? Look at that. Oh, that door open. What is this nonsense? Get in there. Get in there. Now, get in. There we go. Alright. We'll sleep. Um, in the last episode, I uh, I killed some sheep, so I got a bed. Um, but this is all I really have right now. Hopefully no monsters kill me. Um, if you guys hear some sounds in the background... Um, I'm using my uh, my uh, audio mic, so I still got to figure out what settings I want it to. So if you guys hear this sound, I don't know if that's going to be picking up in the video. That's my chair. It's a really comfortable chair, but it's kind of a squeaky chair. So I got to move the least amount of possible. Um, you didn't escape, did you? Is that... No. Okay. So you guys are there. Awesome. Um, 
And uh, you guys might actually hear some meowing if you guys love cats. Because so I got a cat that loves to meow. And I say this, that she's the meowiest cat that has ever meowed in my whole entire life. So with that said... What's her dirt in here? With that said, uh, if you guys hear some meowing... Um, I I, I want to say I, I can kind of stop it, but then I kind of really can't. Because if, if you guys know cats... Especially if they're needy cats, if you lock them out of the room, they're just going to paw and meow, and the mic's still going to pick it up. But if I let her in, she might meow a little bit, and if I ignore her, then she'll just kind of chill and just kind of, you know, sit there and do nothing. Hopefully don't meow so much. Alright, they're still in there, right? Okay, I gotta stop focusing on those guys. I gotta figure out what to do. Okay, so Minecraft. Uh, food. Okay, I can get the I can get wheat, it's wheat and carrots and all that jazz. Um, I can actually make a hoe. Make a hoe, make a hoe, kind of make a hoe. Um, I need sticks. There you go, I got sticks. Um. Oh yeah, if you guys want to check out my guy, I am. I don't know what this is from. Or oh, whoops, wrong button. Uh, this is Astrid from Skyrim, and I don't know who the heck that is. Uh, but the main reason why I chose this character because they're red and black, and I have recently been addicted to Naruto uh, TV shows. So you know, you're thinking red black ninja. You're thinking Uchiha, and the Uchiha clan's awesome. Um, actually, you know, that's a good question to ask you guys. Um, if you guys can write down in the comments, if it's pronounced, uh, Naruto, or Naruto, or how the heck it's pronounced, because I know that in the show they don't say Naruto at all, in the English or the Japanese, and I watched both. Like, I've watched the, the English, uh, version first, until... And until like, I got caught up, and then I watched like the Japanese version for like when the fourth Great Ninja War and whatnot, because it started in the English version, but it hasn't gotten to the same point as the Japanese one. So, uh, but yeah, I was always I always have trouble saying the name because in the show they pronounce it like Naruto, like the U is silent. But when I'm talking to my friends, I say well. Not to people who already know the show, but if I'm talking to someone who doesn't really know the show that well, I say Naruto because they look at the name and see, oh, there's a U in there, so you gotta pronounce the U. So you guys let me know if I'm just making a fool out of myself or how it's actually pronounced. And uh, let me pick up these carrots here. But uh, I haven't really been into... Uh, Animes for a really long time. When I was a kid, my favorite show was Dragon Ball Z, and I still love Dragon Ball Z to this day. And we will be playing Dragon Ball Z yet again on the channel. It's just... It was a hassle, because I was trying to record with just using the PlayStation system. And the PlayStation thing would cut out the... Oh, uh, fuck off PlayStation. It would, uh, it would cut out the cutscenes and say that I could not record them. Which was really annoying... So, for you guys watching at home, you would see me fight some guy, blank screen, then I'd be in a whole different place, and you guys wouldn't know what happened. So, I'm thinking what I'm going to do is, I'm not really that far ahead, so I was actually thinking about starting from scratch, building a new character. I actually had an idea for a new character, I'm not sure. And uh, going from there, starting from scratch, and so then you guys can see everything. And you pigs, you just, you just want these carrots, don't you? So, uh, yeah, that's going to be coming in the future. But anyways, big fan of Dragon Ball Z um, when I was a kid. Uh, okay, there. Get out of here. Um, oh, get out of here. No real pigs were harmed in the making of this film, of this video. Get some more. What are these? Potatoes or onions? Potatoes. Um, I'll put carrots down. Apparently carrots are better. Um, yeah, so, so I like that show. Really good. Um, Inuyasha was another anime that I watched a bit of. 
It was on really late when I was a kid, so I didn't watch it too much. Um, but I wanted to get into it, and a friend of mine said that he's watching it right now, and he started watching because they actually ended in Yasha. I don't know if it was like sooner or later, but that ended. So all the all the seasons are done. So I might start watching that too. But yes, I started watching Naruto, and I just love it. And I actually was thinking that I like it more than Dragon Ball Z, which is a lot because I'm a really big fan of Dragon Ball Z. Um, the main thing I would say about the show is that with Dragon Ball Z, from I think it was like even season one where Raditz came down with uh, oh jeez, I got the burps. Oh, excuse me. Um, where when Raditz came down, and essentially what happened is uh, Raditz came down, and then Nappa and Vegeta came down, and they said that they had the power to destroy the planet, and they can do all this stuff. So they could destroy planets in season one, and then from there on out, everyone gets stronger. Vegeta, Gohan, Goku, they all get to a point where they all can. Well, actually, well not Krillin, Krillin and Yamcha and all those guys, they can't destroy, destroy planets. I know of. But, uh, yeah, so they all get to this power where they can destroy plant planets. They just keep on getting stronger and stronger and stronger. And it gets to the point where it's just meaningless for the fighting. Like, the fighting sequences are awesome, and I love the energy blasts and the moves. But it's just like, if you were fighting against Goku, just, just, just shoot, like, several um, energy blasts that can blow up the planet from different angles... Yeah, sure, he can stop one or a couple with instant transmission, but eventually the planet's going to get destroyed, and then there goes the Dragon Balls, and I don't know what you're going to do. So it's kind of hard putting things in peril. And then also with the with the Dragon Balls, you know, oh yeah, we'll just we'll just revive them. That's kind of another thing where it doesn't really put things in peril at times. But I like I still love the show, I really do. But then with Naruto, in another case. Um, I don't want to spoil anything for anyone that has been watching it. I'll just say that if, if, if you don't watch the show, I'm sure you still know what a tailed beast is at some point. But basically there's these things, these tail beasts, and they're very powerful. And at most, I think they can destroy, they said they can destroy great nations. At most. And, uh, there isn't, well, at, that I know of, maybe there is later on, but that I know of, there is no jutsu that can destroy the whole planet. And I'm just wandering around, not focusing on the game. And you, sir, are gonna die. Give me that pork. Oh, that sounded bad. I gave him my pork. Ha! Ha! Ha, bad jokes for days. There we go. Uh, just chicken. Aw, oh, buddy. Buddies. I won't let you guys, I won't let you guys stay there and think about what you did. Um, okay, so I got food. We should go digging at some point. Let me just venture around here. I'll let you get my map out so I can kind of clear that up. See if there's any caves. But yeah, the show, I really like it a lot. Um, I love how... With all the types of jutsus, like for example, there's like fire style and lightning style and wind style and water style. And all these different types of styles which creates different move types where, ooh, there is a mushroom island over there. Whereas Dragon Ball Z, um, lots of people just like to use the Kamehameha. I understand Goku using the Kamehameha. And Gohan using the Kamehameha, and Krillin using the Kamehameha, and Cell using the Kamehameha. I understand all that because Master Roshi taught Goku, and Goku taught Gohan, Master Roshi taught Krillin. Makes sense. And Cell steals everyone's moves. That's just his creation, so I understand that. But when you have Majin Buu, a guy from a different part of the universe who's seen and fought so many enemies, and he has all this power, and he also uses the Kamehameha, like... You know, Kamehameha is an awesome move, but you would think that, that you would get some div um, some diversity moves in there. Like with Naruto, um, uh, I want to keep saying Naruto until you guys correct me, because I want to make sure I'm saying it right. But Naruto, 
Um, I just broke my axe. Uses the Rasengan, because Jiraiya was his sensei, and Jiraiya taught him. And then Jiraiya also taught his father, so his father uses the Rasengan. And I don't know if Jiraiya came up with the Rasengan, but he uses it too. So that's three people, but it kind of makes sense. Like, they're all within the same teachers, I guess you could say. And, uh... But no one else does. Well, I think Mecha Naruto does. But, you know, that's just a copy of Naruto, so that makes sense. Um, yeah. So, like, like, uh, Jiraiya. If, and this is going on if you guys don't know the show. So this is, I guess, for people who watch the show. Um, if Jiraiya taught Nagato, Yaiko, and Konan... Jutsu. He didn't teach them the rest Sangon. They all have their own special du Jutsus. So I thought that was pretty cool. But anyways, enough about Naruto. Enough about comparing the two. Let's focus on Minecraft. So I think it's been two days so far since I started recording. And we haven't done any mining. <laughs> we, we got food. Um, I would like to put up some torches around here. I'm probably going to replace all the cobblestone with stone brick. I usually do that with every Minecraft game I play. Make the houses a little bit neater and kind of build off from this village. Or I could start selling myself and say, screw you guys. But those two guys in that room, that's just too good. I ne I've never seen that with all the times I play Minecraft. So, um, let us go adventuring, I suppose. I'll see if I can find a, uh, somewhat of a cave entrance. Like maybe a little chasm or something going on. And what I'll do is from there... Oh, there's a wolf. Do I have any bones? I don't. Um, what I can do from there... Hello, Mr. Wolf. Is I can uh, go down there and start digging. I like this forest area. It's nice and peaceful. Oh... Um, boop -a -doop -a -doop -a -doop -a -doop. a question for you guys. I don't know. I don't know if it'll be like a question of the day or whatnot. But if you guys play Minecraft, which I'm sure some of you do, um, what area do you like to start off in? Do you when you start a game? Do you go for a specific area? Do you just start off where the spawn is? Like, do you like the forest area, or if you look over there, I think there's some snow over there, so you can go in the snow area. Ooh, that looks cool. Or the desert, or the marshlands, or... Is there anything else? I guess there's the prairies. Like, Oh yeah, and then there's the jungle. But I was going to say, like, this is forest, but then, the, then there's places like this that will remove all the trees, and it'll just be, like, grass, and be, like, the prairies. Okay. I don't know why this is dark. Um... Got eight torches. Got some cobblestone there. I could dig down here and just kind of do a stairway. I personally like to find those, uh... Hmm. I was, I'm just saying to myself if I should go and find like a natural hole and just go down the tunnel and see where it leads to. Or if I should just dig straight down from where my village is and then start digging from there. Because then I can just backtrack if I ever get lost. I think that sounds like a better idea because then I can just go backwards. Because there's nothing more ag um, aggravating than um, going in a mine and then getting filled up on stuff. And then having to come back to your um, place to unload all your loot. And then never going back in that mine again because you feel like there's nothing there and it'd be boring to recheck it because you'll just be looking at other stuff that you found. And But then sometimes you miss some stuff there. Like maybe there's a chest full of like CDs or a monster spawner chest that has a sword or diamonds or what have you. I guess saddles would be the monster spawner thing now since there's horses. But uh, yeah... We'll just get this coal, and I think that's what I'm going to do. It's always good to find some coal. Alright. Pick that up. 
There we go. Got some coal. I should really kill those pigs. Oh, I'll kill you guys another time. When I get a sword, I gotta make some tools. I get some stone. I get some iron. Have some iron stuff to have. Um, just another thing that I uh, talk to you guys about is I'm playing Minecraft right now, but Minecraft definitely won't be the only game I'll be playing. Um, I know that there's a lot of YouTubers out there that kind of stick to one main game, and that might be me for. I don't know, somewhere down the line. I'm just trying things out for the time being. And I personally would love to play multiple games just so then things are always fresh instead of just playing one game where after a while I can kind of get, you know, boring, the same old thing. And I want to have a good time. I don't know, you guys want to have a good time. And that's what this is all about. And eventually the charity live streams because I think... That's something I really want to do. Well, not something I think. That's something I really do want to do and make happen. And I didn't know this was here. Does this go down to a cave of some sort? Where does this go to? Okay, that's a dead end. I could just dig straight down from here, and then this could be my entrance, and then just kind of dig from here. Hmm. That might be a possibility. Oh, here we go. And where does this go to? Where's my torches? I wish you could just hold a torch. Like like what I'm doing now. And it would light up the way instead of you placing one down. I'm going to get this coal and then I'm going to get out of here. But yeah, so f just a heads up for you guys. Um, we'll be playing a whole lot of games on this channel for the time being. That might change in the future. Who knows what the future is going to hold. But I'm looking forward to it. Uh, games I have planned for now are, well, Minecraft, um, GTA, of course, um, uh, Battlefield Hardline, um, trying to th I, I have, like, a whole bunch of games, just trying to remember what games, Dragon Ball Z, already said, um, I have, uh, what else do I have? Have anything else? I want to have Far Cry. And Far Cry is kind of an iffy game. I've beat it once before, and my plan was to restart and have you guys choose like which side I choose and have some funny shenanigans. But it's just with Far Cry, it's just, I don't know. I have to get back into it because I was playing it a little before and I just kind of found it boring. Like, I have everything unlocked and have all the areas done, beat the whole game. But, uh, yeah, just, uh, wasn't having as much fun as, as I thought it would be. Oh, I have Dying Light, which is that kind of free mode style game. So we might play Dying Light first and then maybe head back to Far Cry or do a little bit of both. I'm still not sure about that. And I think that's it for the PlayStation. And then eventually, hopefully soon, I will be uh, setting up my uh, PC gaming, which is also going to be on here. But I don't know exactly what... Well, I don't know exactly what my setup's going to be. If I'm just going to be doing live streaming off PC. Or if I'm going to still put videos out. It's a whole mix match. But yeah, those games include like Gmod. So we'll be playing a whole lot of Prop Hunt, TTT, Melon Bomber, Death Run. All that fun stuff. Um, I... Uh, I, I recently bought uh, Battle Block Theater, which is a game I had for Xbox 360. That was a lot of fun. What else was there? Was there anything else there? Yeah, Portal. I bought Portal. Uh, Scribble Knots. I would like to do for a live stream at some point. Um, there's other games out there. We got lots of games, lots of content. It's just trying to figure out how to put that PC content on here as well because I just set up my PlayStation 4 so now I got to set up all this and uh, if you guys haven't noticed I'm kind of a noob to this so uh it's just figuring out what to do and how to do things but you know what I wouldn't I wouldn't like it any other way I'm glad I'm doing this I really wanted to do it and I'm glad that things are working out 
We'll get this done. Hmm, sun setting. Well, you know what you got. You know what you guys. I think I'm gonna be calling it at the end of a video really soon. Probably just gonna let the sun set, go to sleep, wake up, and then I'll probably do another video. We'll still probably be on Minecraft, but just uh, make these videos kind of. Um, what's the word I'm looking for? More spread out. Because I, I don't know how long this video is, to be honest with you, just rambling on to you guys. I totally forgot about the time, which is another thing i got to be wary of when I'm doing these videos. Uh, I want to say around 10 to 15 minutes, maybe 20, depending on how, um, how I want to set things up. Maybe things will be longer for now. Like, because right now with my schedule, like all next week I won't be putting up any videos because I'll be studying for exams. Which sucks, but um, but what I can do is that I got this weekend off, so maybe what I can do for you guys is I can maybe do longer videos and put those up this weekend, so they're longer. You guys have a lot of content, and then uh, oh yeah, I gotta go sleep here because I don't want people to spawn and kill me. But then when I get into a rhythm of three days a week, or even, I might even do four. I might get a Saturday in there, too, so you guys get to watch on the weekends. Maybe, like, a Sunday or a Saturday. But once I get into a rhythm, once I get every, everything figured out, there'll probably be 10 to 15 minutes. And, uh, yeah, it should be a whole lot of fun. Actually, I kind of want to say I want to do videos daily. I really want to do that, but I don't want to promise you guys that and then not... You know, fulfill my promise, because that would suck. So, I'm just going to say three to four days a week, but I would like to do, like, five days a week, like, Monday through Friday, and then maybe do, like, live streaming on the weekends of some sort. Oh, Town of Salem. I, I totally forgot about that. Town of Salem's definitely going to be in there. There's a lot of, there's a lot of PC games I, met, I haven't mentioned that are going to be on there. But anyways, I'm going to end this off here. So, I have to say to you guys, thank you so much for putting up with my nonsense of trying to find everything. But, uh, you guys are awesome. Stay cool. I'll see you guys.